greeting from the Tao Garden, northern part of Thailand. I want to share you the information of the one of the healing techniques. It's very powerful. And we call it Qi Nei Zhang. Qi means energy, Nei Zhang means organs. So um, the Qi Nei Zhang are very emphasized in the uh, abdominal area. And uh, we know that the abdominal area, you can see that when you touch in the beginning, you have immediately you affecting the um, small intestine. Okay? And in the Taoism and in the West, they discover that the small intestine actually is a second brain. And um, they are so much connecting to their um, brain up there and the heart. Heart also regarding another brain. So from the small intestine, you have the large intestine. And there are much, very reflexology point on the last intestine. And you have go down to the uh, aorta vena cava, which is very important controlling the whole circulation in the body. And the, um, we have the liver on the right hand side, and um, pancreas, spleen, stomach, all vital organ is in the abdominal which we can reach and we can be corrected. So the Qi Nei Zhang is a hand-on healing. And another theory in the Tao and the West find out that is working really now is the um, emotional, okay? Emotional store and clot in the organ and connecting with the brain. Any emotional we have here, it will be refracting. So um, the, uh, the basic training, basic healing of the Qi Nei Zhang is that you teach the person, you help them release and correcting the energy. So the first thing you need to learn how to charge the forces and you learn how to connecting with the tree. So we have called three meditation and three therapy. So when you learn how to be three meditation and three therapy, you can, when, sometimes you, when you touch on a person, you might pick up the sick energy or release the emotional. And you need to let go to the tree. And, um, and you need to learn to meditation and radiate out the compassion, chi, and energy and charge with the primordial force. And when you touch, so uh, we have the first thing is that you learn how to feel how the differences in here. So in the West usually is that I have a rock in my stomach. So this massage are very different from only massage on the leg, the arm, the head and the back. But the sickness is come from the abdominal. And the abdominal, especially the navel, connecting to all the body, all the organ and nervous system, okay? So um, when you, so we call one finger technique. You start with the navel, and you start to find what wrong inside there. Usually, when you touch, you're gonna have what we call by the aorta vena cava. It's um, one of the major circulation of the body. So when you touch and you feel the pulse, okay? And um, the pulse is supposed to be most on the left-hand side. So you go to adjust the pulse, and we call opening the wind gate. So we are eight corner of opening the wind gate, and we have skin detoxify and organ detoxify. Because the small intestine, sometimes they clogged. Because the small intestine, they're twisted, okay? And they're curved. So you, sometimes you need to really um, find a curve of the small intestine. Okay? When you find the curve, the small intestine have many curves and we have more than um, 18 feet long. Okay? The small intestine and large intestine is very long. Okay? And um, usually the food, if we don't eat well, the food will stuck in the small intestine and the large intestine. So number one, 
of the chini uh, jang is people have to clean out the last intestine and when you work on the small intestine anything that stuck in the small intestine will move now the next one like the liver liver on the right hand side under here the rib cage here and is the one that store a lot of toxic emotional so we believe that it store emotional toxic and digestive juice so if we some people when they have so much emotional smoking uh, taking a lot of toxic drugs and they will have very hard in the, um, the liver so we have to learn how to massage the liver learn how to massage the pancreas for people that have too much sweet you can find the pancreas are swollen up and there are very certain technique to massage to release and break and revitalize the organs and it's very interesting that a lot of sick organ is degenerating and if you are put a little bit pressure breakthrough or uh, I should not say breakthrough or we, we make the damaged cell or, or old cell or not good cell you break them out and the very interesting about the stem cell when you break them out and the chi give the information the stem cell will come and repair it that's why the, um, the, the technique of the chi ni chang it work because when you all, often time you can see that people abdominal is hard like a rock so you have to go there and you break them so the good cell is there but the negative cell or the sick cell or degenerating cell getting old cell when you shake a little bit and you break a little bit it breaks out so the stem cell will only do the repair work when they are damaged so it's very interesting about the chi ni chang if you go there enough force with the chi information chi when you do meditation also chi when you move the chi you give information to the stem cell to the damaged cell old cell degenerate cell you get rid of it and the body will start to do the healing and the healing take place okay so the chi ni chang it not only relax now we work system by system so in the skin detoxify we're working a lot of lymphatic system okay when the super fishes and when you get deeper down you have the lymphatic duct and a lot of people have very tight and tension duct of this one and this duct actually very tight so it's right way behind so if you take organ by organ come out you can see the small intestine and near the last intestine and the liver and the kidney and we have the um, kidney on the back kidney on the back the lady have the uterus so we have to learn how to correct it, the uterus because a lot of time uh, the uterus are tilt to one side so you tilt one side from here tilt back, tilt up, tilt down and uh, no matter how kind of medicine, acupuncture, whatever you do unless you're collecting the twist you're collecting the twist and you put it back and uh, cramp the pain the, um, the ori cramp, the uterus cramp and pain will start it to be corrected okay? and the pain gone and the meditation stop that means they will not come out so much okay? and a lot of rock when you press into the abdominal you start to find a lot of lump a lot of rock a lot of a tangle and twist and in the Davos we believe that this is a beginning of what we call by stroke sickness and all kind of degenerating and the circulations so in the Tao said you are as young as your abdominal abdominal so in the in the chini chang is very emphasized in a one finger technique one finger technique and it's a very important part that you are working on the um, breaking all the hard thing tight tension and the uh, ligament emotional always come up so we have a special way to 
uh, for example, you find some place very painful, and um, when you press it down, people will be very painful. Sometimes it's really pain. So you can have the people focus on the pain, and you start it to move your eye, I tell the person to move the eye and smile to the pain part. And also can move the tongue together with the eye, left, right, left, right, and focus and the tongue moving also, and focus on the, um, on the pain part. Oftentimes, a lot of emotional, a lot of stress, a lot of sickness are manifest in here as attention, tightness, and pain. Okay? So we have a tremendous uh, healing uh, testimony in the Chine Chang. So the thousand we believe like angry, jealousy store in the liver, and the heart store, the hatred, impatience, hastiness. So we have uh, to work, a method to work on the sternum and the knuckle to get deep into the heart, to clear the heart. Okay.